Hey, what is up, YouTube? Thank you very much for tuning into my channel, Lando Tech. And boy, have I got some interesting news for you. I think we're all very much aware that we can easily cast YouTube videos to Chromecast. But in this video, I want to show you how you can cast your entire desktop to Chromecast using either the Google Chrome browser or the Microsoft Edge browser. We'll start with the Google Chrome browser. Once you've launched the browser, click on the three dots at the top right. Then find the cast option on the list of options and click it. If you click on your Chromecast device without changing the default settings, it will only cast the tab you currently have opened. However, if we stop this and click the sources drop down, we then see the option to cast screen. Clicking on this option will not only display the entire web browser, but it will also display the entire desktop. So when you open folders and browse through files, this will be replicated on the TV being casted too. As I mentioned previously, you can do the same thing for Edge, and I'll show you how. I know we love to hate on Microsoft Edge, but it does collect a lot less of your personal data than Google Chrome does. With that being said, both browsers still collect a good amount of your personal data. So the best way to maintain your privacy while browsing online is to use a VPN. Norton VPN is currently having a sale, and if you use the link in my description below, you can get it for 69% off. So to cast from Edge, go and launch the Edge browser. Click the three dots at the top right. Click More Tools, then Cast to Media. Now click the Sources drop-down menu. Select Cast Screen, then click your Chromecast device and you will now see a mirror of your computer screen appearing on your TV. There you have it. You now know how to cast your entire screen to Chromecast. Thank you very much for watching my video guys. If you found this helpful, please click the like button. If you want to see more videos like this, subscribe by clicking my logo at the bottom right of this video. Don't forget to click the notification bell to be notified when I drop a new video.